Their life ends here. Let's shake a leg. I shall not falter. Forwards. Enemy near. Oh. I'll go ahead. I feel faint. Spell's not working like- Calm down. Not dead yet. Does anyone require my counsel? I'm not touching that. Don't- ah. I didn't even break a sweat. So that's a mere flesh wound. I we will be victorious. Let's hear. Let us bide our time. Adventures await. Defeat is not an option. All I see is blackness. I we the path is clear. None. This will hurt. Time's not waiting. Our story started at the mansion of an Aldori sword lord. 
drawn by the promise of a most dangerous task and a commensurately huge reward. Heroes of all stripes gathered here. Where are they? This is taking forever! I didn't even say what this was for, just that the Eldori were looking for heroes. Who are the Eldori anyway, rich folk? If you can't be patient, no one's keeping you here. Just go back to your mountains or whatever hole you crawled out of. The Eldori Sword Lords run the premier school for the dueling arts. They're also the richest and most influential group in this part of Brevoy. Take that tone with them, and they'll teach you some manners pretty quickly. All right, you purple toad, just shut your trap. And if you can't, I'll help you. Hush! Quiet! They're coming. Greetings, everyone. I am Sword Lord Jamandi Aldori, and this is Lord Mayor Yosef Selimius of Restov. Welcome to my mansion. We thank you from the bottom of our hearts for responding to our call. You may be few, but that's unavoidable. We need only the best of the best for this task. And I see true heroes before me, strong and fearless, exactly what Restov needs. Thank you, Lord Mayor. Now, to the point. South of here, just beyond Brevoy's border, lies a region known as the Stolen Lands. This is disputed territory, and while it's long been claimed by nearby states, it's never been truly taken. I won't bore you with the legal technicalities. Suffice to say that anyone with enough courage and power to seize the Stolen Lands and name themselves Baron or Baroness, claiming dominion, well, none of the neighboring states would be able to challenge it. Of course, Restov would be first to recognize the legitimacy of this new state, as well as the noble title of its founder. Unfortunately, one serious obstacle stands between you and this title. A gang of bandits hold sway in the Stolen Lands. Their chief, who they call the Stag Lord, considers himself the rightful owner of these lands, and no one has yet been able to challenge his power. Bring me his head, and you'll be able to return to the Stolen Lands as their legal ruler. Any questions? Don't ask stupid questions. Why should you even care? What they have to gain and why, that's for Lady Aldori and I to discuss. It's none of your concern. Your only concern is to swing your sword around, or whatever it is you do. Of course we stand to benefit from this enterprise. But if you're concerned that we intend to rule your country from afar, using you as a front, well, please know that these concerns are unfounded. Let's just say that we have a strong interest in the region's stability. We have need of a ruling power we can negotiate with. Not bandit gangs and monster hordes. What is that smell in the air? Is it the smell of unspoken words and political intrigue? I will, of course. I'm the leader of this team, after all. Don't worry, though. I'll make it worth your while to help me. We haven't yet begun, and you already speak of divvying rewards. What makes you think we'll even succeed? There's little point arguing over who gains the title, when we'll most likely lose our lives there. Ahem, <clears throat> if I may please answer the question. We believe you're all equally deserving of a noble title. Over the course of your expedition, it will be up to you as a team to decide which of you is best suited to rule. Excellent. You venture forth tomorrow. For now, you can take some time to get to know one another better. Or you can head straight to your guest rooms to get some rest. You'll find we've already prepared supplies for you there. 
and thank you again for agreeing to take part in this expedition. I wish you luck. Thank you again, with all my heart, for replying to this call. The flare in your eyes reveals your courage, the unshakable will that distinguishes true heroes. I look at you, O oh champions of Restoff, and doubt not for a second that you'll be victorious. So venture forth toward your feet. Go, and return in triumph. Hi, my name's Lindsay. I'm a bard, though this is my first real adventure. So, shall we go teach this stag lord a lesson? Likewise. Actually, I also wanted to ask you something. How do you feel about this Tartuccio fellow? I think he's pretty obnoxious personally. He appointed himself head of the team, and he's just after the Baron's crown, or whatever it is Baron's wear. Doesn't matter. I don't like him. I think you should be team leader. When I first saw you, I couldn't help but think, now here's a real hero. Someone who'll be praised in poems and songs. This... This is the person I'll write my book about. And what are you a mercenary for? Is it only riches? Or maybe you want glory too? Don't you want your feats to be remembered and glorified for centuries? Just listen. You know what the trouble with most heroes biographies is? They're always written years later based on the tales of, best case, people who saw things from the outside. Worst case, someone heard about it from their brother, who heard it from their friend, who heard it from their cousin, and so on, adding a new batch of lies each time. Every time I read about a heroic journey, I think to myself, why didn't they just bring a bard with them to write it all down properly? And then I thought, I could be that bard. I just needed to find a suitable hero and volunteer to follow along on their glorious adventure. A great plan, huh? And here we are, with a heroic journey lying before us. Who's going to be the hero? Some dwarf who keeps muttering about how we'll all die? Or maybe that horrific scythe lady? Or gods forbid, Tartuccio? No way. Oh yeah, she's fantastic. You can tell she could tear a bear's head off with her bare hands, but she kind of scares me just a little. But. I mean, her sword's twice as big as I am. She could cut me down without even noticing. Just think on it a bit, all right? I'm sure you'll agree. All right, I'm going to my room to write about tonight. See you in the morning. All according to plan. In due time. That, that is not far. It should be.
enemy yeah. approaching. This should do it. <laughs> A calculated risk. This will hurt. Let's try this way. This should do. <laughs> uh, I am prepared. In due time. All, all according to plan. I know what to do. We will be victorious! Calculated risk. This will hurt. Let's try. You're just in time. A bit longer, and I'd have been. Whew, I don't even want to think about it. Can you imagine what a terrible loss this would have been? But it's all right now. I'm safe, sound, and unscathed, ready to lead you to victory. Lady Jamandi's holding the line in the banquet hall. 
You know, the one where she had us gathered before. We need to make our way to her. And along the way, we'll try to save some of these dummies who are supposed to accompany us to the Stolen Lands. Speaking of dummies, take this ring. Quiet now, so that little fool doesn't hear us. She might try to steal it herself. It's magical. It'll protect you. You'll need it while you work to defend me. Time's not waiting. Focus on the goal. Ready for anything. I need to concentrate. Becoming distracted leads to becoming dismembered. What to do? This works for me. No mistakes. All according to plan. Focus on the goal. I, I know what to do. I am prepared. Time's not waiting. This works for me. Our victory is certain. This should do it. Down. Not dead yet. I know what to do. Ready for anything? Just letting the ink dry. I, I wrote it like I saw it. Time's wasting. I, I deserve better. Me. 
focus on the goal. And, and so they walked on. I am prepared. I'm trusting you here. No mistakes. Time's not waiting. Ready for anything. Focus on the goal. Follow my lead. I am prepared. I know what to do. Right. No mistakes. Time's not waiting. Focus on the goal. I am prepared. I'm by your side. It's the end for you rats! Don't Can push we make me. an epic pose? I need inspiration. A calculated risk. This will hurt. Strike you down. Blood for Gorum! Barbarians. I think that's exactly how heroes should be. What, stupid, sweaty, and always looking for something to gobble up or lop the head off of? Calistria, save me from such heroes. Th that is not far. was called for. Ready for anything? This works for me. I know what to do. Anything is possible.
Time's not waiting. Focus on the goal. All according to plan. Should be. I know what to do. A trivial matter. They dare to attack me? one to me. Let's try this way. This should do it. You must die already! You deserved it. No mistakes. I am trusting you here. I am prepared. Ready for anything. I'd 
adventures complete. This works for me. Time's not waiting. Don't push me! It is finished. Focus on the goal. Right. No mistakes. I know what to do. Ready for anything? What have we here? This chest is full of gold. I guess it's for the guard salaries, all things considered. Well, those freeloaders don't seem to have been working too hard for it. Ma what? No, we're heroes, not thieves. Who said we were stealing it? We'll just take the gold for safety so the assassins don't get it. And then we can heroically return it to Jamandi when this is all over. Does she know it was us and not the assassins? Unless... Don't drag me into this. You do what you want, but I'm not taking a single coin. And so they walked on. Time's not waiting. All according to plan. Oh, familiar faces. I hope you're not so frightened as to swing at every shadow. It's me, Jathol. I don't recommend advancing down the hallway, assuming you value your life, of course. There were a few people with me, and you can see what happened to them. And just how did they all end up dead while you don't seem to have a scratch? I'll answer but briefly and just once. Further scares and explanations will wait until we aren't being hunted by a group of assassins. Deal? All right. I'm undead. These traps are deadly to the living, but they're harmless to me. What do you mean, undead? Really? Like zombies or skeletons or...? As I said, further explanations will wait until later. All you need to know right now is that we're on the same side, and we have to fight off a small army of hired assassins. Let's get to it. In due time. I am prepared. I interesting. A trivial matter. All according to plan. How curious. No mistakes. I, I will grant your request. A trivial matter. It is finished. I know what to do. This works for me. Ready for anything. Let's make this quick.
A calculated risk. This is where I step in. you right. <laughs> This will hurt. You deserved it. He's not waiting. That is possible. Focus on the goal. No mistakes. I am prepared. You can count on me. Ready for anything. I know what to do. Time's not waiting. I'm trusting you here. Follow my lead. I need to concentrate. Becoming distracted leads to becoming dismembered. <laughs> 